Here we have seen how to create a chemical formula using an external website and this was the website we had used and this is the formula uh, this is the key we had to press uh, to write the number just side down isn't it so let's extend this video and make one more question suppose uh, the question is if S2O stands for water so in this word file if S2 stands for water what is CO2 stands for CSO3 stands for what CO2 stands for what just I'm giving an example uh, it could be anything uh, it depends on uh, chemistry here what what should be the question but uh, just an example I'm giving so uh, suppose let me add one more question and if I'm writing make it as a short paragraph and the question is let's say if H2O so how to go it how to write it as 2 I simply go to this website and just write H underscore to O and if I'm copying it if this stands for water then it's a CSO2 so how do you write carbon dioxide C underscore 2 sorry C O capital O underscore 2 so CO2 stands for that's the one question another question let's say CSU3 so how can we write calcium carbon that is C A C O underscore shift underscore that is 3 CSU3 stands for question mark Similarly, the last one, SO2, that is sulfur dioxide. So, how do you write SO underscore 2? SO2. That was dance. So, this is one simple question I have made. Uh, you can see in the previous section, if you click on preview. <coughs> and this is one. so you can write your answer here yeah, let's say this is for carbon dioxide then calcium carbonate this is sulfur simply write it sulfur dioxide so in this way you right then so I think uh, this is clear for all of you to how to make simple chemical formulas so in the next video we'll see the advanced version of chemical formulas so thank you very much